Hail thee well and welcome all. I'm the Jake of all trades and this is the Master of Fun show. If you see this little thing poking up on the corner of the screen here, this is uh, my pipe. I don't know if it's okay to smoke tobacco on YouTube or not. I'll look into it. This channel isn't monetized though, so I don't think it'll be a problem. You'll never see ads on this channel. This is more of a hobby for me, not really a source of income. If you want to support me, let me know and I will be sure to... If enough people let me know, I'll figure something out. But in the meantime, just enjoy these uh, videos as they are. And um, this is uh, going to be a little untraditional for the uh, Master of Fun show, as you can probably already tell. This is uh, This video is going to be... A song, actually, and it's going to be a song written by, uh, in character, by one of my characters, Siddlefix of Clan Knackle. He was a gnome bard who was adventuring with Mekenia, and she was a, uh, a human dragon blood sorcerer, and there was Rogrim, and he was a human uh, barbarian, I'm pretty sure. And together we made the mighty band known as Veritas in Viribus. And one day, while we were traveling through the woods, we encountered a, a, a den filled to the brim with Dragon. And if you don't know what those are, I'm going to be showing a picture over here to give you an idea. I'll give you a quick recap as well. They've been a monster in Dungeons & Dragons since uh, the first edition I found out. I looked it up. I had only ever fought them um, in third or later, so um, I was not aware of this. But, um, yeah, they're a pretty classic monster. They're like a cross between a, um, they're like a cross between a, a, a dragon and a lion, I guess. And, um, they, they have, like, instead of fur, though, it's, like, scales and, and sharp, like, wiry hair around, like, for whiskers and stuff like that. And, um, and, like, big wings as well. So they can kind of fly in, like, big, like, leaps and stuff like that. And, um, they were pretty intimidating, but, uh, there was, a, there was a whole bunch of them, too. But, um, it was the first big fight that we had ever had, and, um, it was also an incredible display of power on McKenya's part, and I thought it was worthy of a song. It was the first that, uh, that Siddlefix had written. Um, and there will probably, there was a couple others, I may post those, we'll see how this first one goes. But hey, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you really liked it, leave me a comment and tell me, like, what you liked about it. And that way, you know, that gives me something to work off of. And if you're really excited about, like, new videos that might be coming out, please hit the subscribe button as well. Because, you know, the more subscribers I get, that just encourages me to make more content. So please, let me know what you think. And, um, otherwise, I think, um, I'll let the song speak for itself. Enjoy. The dragon was sleeping and probably dreaming of eating young damsels and dames when we came upon them and tried to withdraw them out of the cauldron and into the flame. Mikenya was casting acid or was blasting a drastic battle we claimed. And when they awoke, they found they'd been coaxed out of the cauldron and into the flame. Out of the cauldron and into the flame Her dragon blood fire burns hotter and brighter Out of the cauldron into the flame With dragon blood fire she lit their death higher A roar was then heard that diminished our nerve and weakened our very strength. But they can yet it say, ha, now they'll come play out of the cauldron and into the flame. Dragon came quickly as Rogrim struck swiftly, he held them all at bay. And through Firewall one, those Dragon had come out of the cauldron into the flame. Out of the cauldron and into the flame, her dragon blood fire burns hotter and brighter. Out of the cauldron into the flame, with dragon blood fire she lit their death fire. Out 
Hasbro Grimm took damage, me Kenya did manage to savage and to maim. Through firewall to those dragon crash through out of the cauldron and into the flame. Fires were crackling, me Kenya was cackling. Firewall three was saved. The days were numbered, they'd never surrender. Out of the cauldron and into the flame. Out of the cauldron and into the flame. A dragon blood fire burns hotter and brighter. Out of the cauldron, into the flame. With dragon blood fire, she lit their death fire. As the stream of them slowed, the sorceress did grow impatient to show her fame. And with lit eyes, she gave them surprise out of the cauldron and into the flame. When the fires were gone, she'd slain everyone. No one could match her game. With dragon blood fire, she lit their death pyre. Out of the cauldron and into the flame. Out of the cauldron and into the flame. Her dragon blood fire burns hotter and brighter. Out of the cauldron. Into the flame with dragon blood fire She lit their death fire That was Out of the Cauldron and Into the Flame, originally penned and performed by Siddlefix of Clan Knackle. I thank you all very much for listening. <laughs>